Hello family and welcome to another episode. I am ready to bet that after the pandemic and all the lockdowns across the world, you have on your bucket list things you want to do. Now that you know that death could be lurking anywhere behind the door. So here is my list of festivals you want to attend before you die. Up first, the Festival of Colors. This is an ancient Hindu festival in India, also known as the Festival of Love. It celebrates the eternal and divine love of Radha Krishna in March. So many symbols of love down in India, including the Taj Mahal, which is part of the Seven Wonders of the New World. I have a video on that, so please check down in the playlist. Second is La Tomatina. No, wait, well, it's a mistake. This is not La Tomatina. This is, well, it is a tomato, but it's. Ah, this is La Tomatina. <laughs> Every year in Brunel, Spain, hundreds of thousands of people gather to partake in this tomato food fight. Yes, you heard right. The celebration was banned in 1940, but then lifted in 1959. So every year, Bunal imports over 319,000 pounds of tomatoes, specially for this parade. How awesome! Up next is the World Naked Bike Ride, which raises awareness for fossil fuels. But unfortunately, we cannot show the visuals here because this, this is a family channel, you know, it's an educational tourism family channel. That includes the Naked Marathon as well. We'll have a separate video where we can show you these visuals. Now, let's go down to Rio de Janeiro in Brazil and see what's happening over there. Also known as the biggest carnival on earth with attendees of over 2 million people parading on the streets. This is a cultural celebration prior to the Lent it dates back to the year 1723, if not the oldest carnival here on our list. It begins 51 days before Easter and lasts for 5 days. Also notable in Rio de Janeiro is the Christ the Redeemer statue, which is one of the seven wonders of the new world. As I said, I have a video on that, so please look for it down in the playlist. Up next, we have the Africa Burn. This annual celebration is hosted in South Africa at the border of Western Cape and Northern Cape Province at the Tanqua Karoo. It first started in 2007 with attendance of 10,000 people, celebrating the creative power of collaboration and creativity. The Burning Man, Black Hole, Nevada, USA. Founded by a Jerry James and Larry Harvey, it celebrates community, art, self-expression and self-reliance with over 78,000 people attending this event. They're also known as Burners. It features unique fashion, elevating rituals and what I love about this is these structures that they create just out of the ordinary absolutely beautiful and overall unwinding experience for the free spirit we 
We're back in India with Diwali. <laughs> it is also known as Deepavali and it celebrates the victory of light over darkness, good over evil, knowledge over ignorance with gifts, fireworks and bright lights decorations. The ninth festival you got to attend before you die is the Mardi Gras, the French Quarter of New Orleans. Also known as Fat Tuesday, the celebration marks the last day before Lent when traditionally people would eat this fatty, rich food before fasting. Now, I don't know if that is genuine fasting when you like try to fatten yourself up before uh, fasting. I don't know, I don't know, but I'm just in it for the food. And now, our very last festival. Um, it is actually uh, my personal favorite. Dia de los Muertos, Day of the Dead. This festival dates back to 3,000 years ago in the Mesoamericans, where they believed that upon dying, a person traveled to a place called Chikunamislan, where they faced nine challenging levels over several years before reaching the final resting place, which is the Mictlan. Now, families would provide food and water as offerings to them to help them on this journey. This inspired the contemporary practice of Day of the Dead. In Mexico, between October 31st and November 2nd every year, the gates of heaven open, and for 24 hours, families would welcome back the souls of their deceased loved ones for this brief reunion that includes food, drink, and celebration. Thanks for watching, folks. Until next time, in part two of festivals, to attend before you die.